Shenmue, eat your mother freaking heart out. You are not the pioneer. There is a doggy outside waiting for it. Oh my god, that's the doggy. Oh my god, this is the most fun I've had in a video game. Please don't have to change your clothes. Guys, this is an open world PS1 game. Oh my god, there actually are cars on the road. I thought I'd be just us. Cock and peaks. I am so headed here, folks. Barbara. Morgan, I've been waiting for you. Did you bring my cigarettes? I don't know what these symbols represent. Run us over, damn it. And look at me, you have like the ice lake. Ah, oh, beautiful environments. We can eat, get a coffee and talk. Well, how much money do I have? O. M. G. The shoulder buttons. That's incredible. Like, you can actually ride a freaking boat in this game. There's a diner. Oh, okay, guys, I'm sorry. We're, we're going off track. Oh, this looks delicious. Oh, we have a problem, sir. Mia, Miss Keisha? Hi, everyone. My name is Leloy, and welcome to Lee's Play. And today, we're going to be playing another obscure PS1 game. This one is called Mizuna Falls, Country of the Woods and Repo. So, well, cutscene. Okay, here we go. This is, this is, this is going to be showing you what this game's all about, actually. Oh, this is a bear? Oh my god. Whoa, what are we going to be doing in this game? Is that a cinema? There's going to be a hold-up punching? Oh my gosh. A bear attack? Robbery? And a big fire. And death by a cemetery. So this is a PlayStation 1 game that came out only in Japan and never got a Western release, but a really dedicated community group that uh, really liked this game have went ahead and localized it for English people in terms of, you know, character names, even this is in English, uh, you know, dialogue, as you saw there, it was in Japanese. Now what makes this game super interesting, by the way, is that this is an open world game on the PS1. And from what I'm reading, it's a genuine open world game. So this is before Shenmue, this is before, you know, Grand Theft Auto 3 on the PlayStation 2. This is on the PS1 we're playing. And um, I'm super excited. So I think without further ado, let's just go in, play the game. We got that sneak preview from the, the video that just auto played. Okay, here we go. PlayStation. And again, we will be doing this on an Xbox Series X controller. Damn it, Origin, leave me alone. Sorry about that. Human entertainment. Two tragedies shatter a peaceful Christmas. Oh, so they translated everything. That's really cool. Good job to the community of this really obscure game. At 6 a.m. in a forest. Oh, it's even in English. I assumed we just have subtitles and it'd be Japanese voiceover. At least she's alive. That's amazing. Good job to the community. Unless maybe it was originally in English, voiceover. Oh, it's not an Irish name. <laughs> Represents. Oh, it's a vampire story. Or a werewolf. Oh, fair enough. It's this Resident Evil village. It's, it's still in me. Okay. Local police suspect the two events are connected. Mm. With a this is so interesting. People, like this is a PlayStation One, one game, and it's, it's like that other game. Deadly Premonition. I hear is a really culty game. It's very much like that, but this is PS One era, and I've and I know Human Entertainment because they've done Clock Tower, which is a game I'm too scared to play. <laughs> I watch other people play it, and it's fantastic. That's my this. Oh, that's like the most fancy ass Leonardo da Vinci style thing. I'm ready for a mystery. I love these types of games. And I heard that this is quite a technical marvel. So let's see if, I mean, apparently it's open world. How cool is that? And people keep talking about Shenmue, but maybe the, 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 these folk did a first. I'm not sure what year this came out. So I'll do an addendum. Ooh, I'm guessing it's going to be paced like Shenmue. I've done the first one, but the second one's so hard. I just can't bring myself to finish Shenmue 2. Bloody mini games. This is cool, and I mean, 
the credits are in English. I, I, I genuinely don't know what they've changed or not. Because to me, I thought this might be pre, that's obviously pre-rendered, but I would have assumed the text was pre-rendered. So I'm like, did they change? Who knows, who knows? But the, whatever the community did, you did a good job. Because this was apparently a Japanese only game, no English version existed. Well, some of it had to be in English. I mean, look at this. <laughs> well, it just takes place in America, obviously. So, I mean, it wasn't like it's gonna be in Japanese, duh. I like the music. I wonder if this will be very Twin Peaks. I actually own a Twin Peaks t-shirt from Kenzo, which is like a designer brand. Uh, but I couldn't find it in my wardrobe for this video, surprisingly. But I've worn it in previous videos. It's such like mountains, like Twin Peaks. But uh, so far, so good. We like a good mystery. It's snowy, it's so much atmosphere for the 32-bit era. And now it's nothing. Prologue. Okay, Christmas Day. A kid getting presents. But we're a teenager. I guess we're gonna be really rebellious. Oh, that's interesting. The emulator says we're going at 15 frames a second. So Matthew says hello. Oh, he's on the phone. Okay, well, they have mobile phones. That's cool. Renona, where are you? Is it? Of course it's me. Okay. They couldn't avoid voiceover artists. I guess it's kind of an indie game. He's really well detailed. He's got some converse. So something's happened to Emma. Start from the beginning. Mm-hmm. So Emma's been out parsing, but maybe she's the quiet. Oh, what does he know? What was he doing last night? Our, our protagonist knows something. Well, I mean, didn't, wasn't there not the news report about the missing... This is cool. Good job, localization folks, community. Oh, his hands are so small, and you know what they say about small hands. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Aren't they all? Because there's a crush on her. Oh, this is interesting. What do those buttons represent? Square, circle. Are they interactive objects? Okay, there's no joy deep joystick support. The analog sticks don't do anything. Okay, so it's like an action button. Can we actually go to sleep? Alrighty. That's, this is cool. It's nicely detailed. Okay, they're animated. So this is my bookshelf. Because you left it on that page. Can I use the television? That would be very technical. Ooh. Oh no, this is like a quick rotate. We might have to... Oh, this, button, this game doesn't use too many buttons from what I'm seeing. All the shoulder buttons are just to rotate your character. So why is this one represented by a circle rather than a square? Okay, so circle is more of an inspect and square is more of an action, maybe? Yeah, I think that could be it. There's a notebook inside. I have to go meet a Pernona though. It's not like I'm going to need this. Does he have like an ensuite? Oh, oh, look, there's a cute doggy outside waiting for us. Oh, that's cute. Uh, what's... Well, I can't tell which room's which. So why is this one a circle? Other oh, boat circle. Wait, I thought that would be the action button. So what's through this door? Ah, we have our own ensuite. Very single, single bed, but big enough for an ensuite. Interesting. Can we take a shower? Can we do a poo? We need to give. We need to do a wee. We do. <laughs> Get the game knows. So it's interesting, it runs at a pretty slow frame rate according to the emulator, 15 frames a second. Uh, thankfully it's a, it's a slow paced game, but that's really, even in small environments. Maybe for the bigger environments, they couldn't get like a 30 frame rate. So they just were like, okay, let's just cap it at 15 for cons consistency. Oh, that is so cute. 
Where is the doggy? I'm excited waiting for it. Oh my god, pet the doggy. Love this game already. Yeah, we're gonna keep going. We can pet this good boy all day long. Good girl, maybe. I think we live in a shed, which is an interesting choice. We don't live in the main house. That angsty teenager look. Get your butt in here. That's obviously the father or father figure. You never know with these types of stories. Speaking of human entertainment, it does actually seem like a lot like Clock Tower. Like it's weird how it renders some objects inside of the space. I would have assumed Clock Tower for the PS1, not the first ever Clock Tower, but like its sequel, which was also just called Clock Tower, kind of had this graphic and environment, but the camera was fixed and would pan in weird ways where this camera follows you. But they do look quite similar. If they had a bigger budget, they could avoid voiceover. So we don't live at our parents, we actually live in like behind a corner shop. That's even more interesting. So this is detective maybe? Town Sheriff. We love a diverse cast of characters. This is awesome. This is Emma. Mm hmm Did something happen to Emma? Why are they questioning us? Why are we prime suspect? In what way was Emma off? Oh, come on. Captain Nas, age 60. Oh, legal guardian. What did I say, father figure? He's like an uncle to the boy. <laughs> I did. I swear I haven't watched any footage, but I just, I'm not gonna lie. You kind of know how these stories go. He runs the town's general store and that's Matthew Lee. Okay. That old tale. The writers think it's not a trope, it's a trope. What are you talking about? Here's the Irish gal, Cathy Flannery. You, I'm guessing emigrated from Ireland, because if that's not the case, she isn't Irish. Okay. Oh, the Jesus freak, poor thing. Barton surrender. Okay, that cannot be an Irish person then. American Irish. But so don't we really talk. Why? The, like, the Bower is forced. It's like Clock Tower, like the Bower Mansion. Human entertainment. I see you. I see you. Breeding, uh, she would have died. Well, at least the female victims are having a better faith in Deadly Premonition, which I'd love to play on this channel. But I think you need a PlayStation. I don't have a PlayStation. Looks like a bear attacked her. They are real violent when that happens. Why is she in the forest? What's that got to do with Emma? The timing's real sus. First cat he turns up hurt. Whoa. And now Emma's been missing since last night. The two could be connected. Plus the strange thing about Kathy is Okay, so Nas is like a bear catching ex expert. We can talk more there. Okay, to the police station. This is cool. I'm so into 32 bit era games right now. Yes, uncle. So we can talk to him. Bears on the loose, killers on the prowl, rough day ahead. So is it like the killer started on? Kathy, but then the bear almost finished her off because of the bear marks. So we run some kind of electronic store is what I'm seeing. It's not a general store, I don't think. It looks too electronic. I mean, the counters look general's purpose, but those are full on TVs, stereos, USB cables. <laughs> That's like where people would, you'd buy USB cables in an electronic store. Clocks, yeah, like this doesn't seem. Look at the poor doggy still rendered out there. That's why your game is running at 15 frames, developers of human entertainment. You need to uh, do like a coded little portal system, like two, because obviously I'm a two murder expert of the engine. You need to, when you're not looking in that direction, you just don't render it because it's done by portals. And if the portal's not in the camera viewpoint, you don't render said polygons. Okay, out we go. Like as much as this game apparently is a technical marvel because it's open world, like the Tomb Raider game engine is so revolutionary for the 32-bit era. I don't think people can appreciate today how much detail can put for a 32-bit system those original Tomb Raiders are. So the sheriff's like, got it. Uh-huh, I'll head over now, tell Father Burton to come too. So change of plans, Matthews. Cassie's regained consciousness, that's great. Can you come with me to the hospital? We're just going all over town. 
I wonder like if the map is gonna be huge. Is it gonna be like Driver 2, which is kind of like an open world 32 bit game, or Driver 2 though had no gameplay outside of the car. I'm hoping this has both. Speaking of which, apparently Tomb Raider is the only 32 bit game that has vehicles in a game, but like where they're not just like a level, like a level. Like when you interact with a vehicle in the classic Tomb Raiders, you can actually get in and out whenever you want. Whereas like in Crash Bandicoot 3, when the girl can ride the tiger on the Great Wall of China, it's like a set level with a finish up end point. Whereas like in Tomb Raider, you can go into the quad bike, the boat, whenever you want. So Rec Ruber Hospital, so I'm just throwing some trivia at you folks. Uh, SUV pulls up, it's not the two of us, obviously. This looks great. I'm actually a big fan of this. It's running out, it's weird, it runs at a low resolution, but the emulator says 3... It says 319, but basically 320 by 224. And it's running at 15 frames. Sense of question, when she called this morning, Emma's mom wasn't just upset, she was absolutely hysterical. But she couldn't have known by Kathy yet, that's only on a need to know basis. Do you know why she would immediately assume the worst? The mother's involved. Emma's kind of grown over the she's thinking. Sometimes her head gets stuck in the clouds for days at a time. I never got that impression from her. She's good at hiding how she would feel. She's like a vase, beautiful but easy to break. Did we break her? Oh, but I'm guessing that's what Mr. Rowan's worried about. I'm a guy, so we couldn't have been close in the same way. Because of our sexual compatibility. <laughs> Because guys can't be friends with girls. What type of society would that be? A productive one. Okay, so here we are in the hospital. She looks like the maid from Silent Hill. Police business, need to speak with the chief of medicine. Is that even a job title? I don't know. I'll, I'll play along too. Barbara, Morgan, I've been waiting for you. Did you bring my cigarettes? I didn't bring your damn cigarettes, Barbara. Barbara Holden, 66, the town eccentric with a pension for cigarettes. That's the only thing she loves more than smoking is being cryptid. How thoughtless life here is dull enough as it is. I'm just gonna give everybody the same accent. I'm not great with this. What about that young man there? Does he have any cigarettes? I'm underage, ma'am. Wait, is this Canadian or American? What a shame. I had such juicy gossip. To gossip. I'm so tired. Gossip to share too. I'm gonna stop, so that'd be really annoying. You're not from around here. I couldn't help myself. Are you? Okay, so we're gonna go see Kathy. Maybe it might be tragedy. It might be a quest to get some cigarettes. <laughs> Underage buying cigarettes is the game. Uh, Chief, we'll meet you in Kathy's room. Let's go. She's in room 201. Oh my god, let me control the bloody damn game. Bring me some cigarettes to come by, Morgan. I am not your personal. I can't bear Sant. She's faking it. What? Bitch, get up. Oh, this is nice. Now, can we be cheeky and go outside? Okay, the game's not that open. This is cool. We can't turn on the TV. I like this. Even though it's on low resolution mode, you can still read the text, like the information. Don't forget to bring cigarettes when you visit. She, okay, she's gonna say the same thing. No, it's, I, I would have been amazed. I would have even listened in Japanese, but it would have been so cool if there's voiceovers. But they're probably like, we can't afford it. No point doing Japanese voiceovers if it's an American town. Can I help you? Are they the same nurse? You can't come back here. It's so cool, because in the Church of Jupiter era, they could probably use the same model and you wouldn't know about it. It's just two blondes working the desk. With the same haircut. <laughs> Is the room okay? What's the map? Ah, I see. This is the problem with this game engine, guys. You need to refine that. You shouldn't be generating the entire map. That's why it's running at a low frame rate because it has to generate this entire room. I think like that. I wonder, was did Sony allow games to run this slow? I mean, it doesn't feel slow to me. Like it feels fine because it's such a slow game, and the character can't run, for example. But was that allowed by Sony to make games for a low res or for a low frame rate? Drop a comment down below if you have any more more examples of low frame rate games. Oh, the controls are a bit. You can go down to the basement if you want to. But what does this 
upstairs, I mean, room 201, I have to assume we go up. So, let's go up. Oh, yeah, this looks like where patience would be. I can just glitch the game engine to see which... Are you joking me? Did it actually render downstairs too? Oh my god, you can run! You have to tap X! Oh guys, life changer. Oh that this is insane. Did you act does it actually render the entire Why who would design this game engine to do such a thing? I need to like hop into a time machine and have some words. Spend a few more months refining the game engine. It could have been high resolution, it could have been beautiful, it could have been 30 frames. Why would you bring us here? We're just, we're just like doing police ride along. How is she doing? Oh, we can hear. Well, we don't you gain consciousness. Your wounds, I'm going into shock. Same as Bosch. Her heart is beating, but her mind doesn't work. Could be trauma, could be brain damage. We'll never know. It's too soon to tell. Can she hear us? So she's like a vegetable. Samuel has no faith. Doctor, how can you say such a thing? Well, that must be. Who said that? The priest? Father Barton. 56. You should never trust the priest. No offense to priests out there. So he adopted Cathy and raised her as his own daughter. Can priests do that? Seems she's awake. Okay. I was like, what was he doing? <laughs> Just wait a bit longer. Would you permit me to pray? What? The priest gets entry, but we don't get to see. Well, they haven't rendered the room, so we'll never, we're never getting in. James. There's another, he's like the intern, I'm sure. No social distancing in this bloody room. Why can't I go in? Why is she screaming? The priest whacked her. Confirmed, it's canon. She did. And we didn't even get to see it. Do we follow you or do we go back to our house and wait for our friend? Can we knock? Too much is happening, I better follow Morgan. Yeah, look, they're just in like cyberspace. They're not even doing anything. I do like the shoulder buttons. That's like quick rotation of character. I wonder if we can do any like triple jumps. Can I help you? Where does she have her hand? Ma'am, that's suspicious. Can you put your hands on the table? Now, can we lose anything while well, we're here? Why is everybody touching their crotch in this game? It's a small hospital. Okay, let's go down to the basement. Oh, I wanted to explore. Can we actually use the elevator? Was that just me being a bit of a... The elevator is rendered. Oh, why did I, why did you automatically go in? I make a mistake. We can go to the basement via the elevator. Here we bloody go, bitch. The game wouldn't let us, but here we are. So I feel we're going to be back here in the future. Okay, let's see where to go, judging by what, what rooms have and haven't rendered. Okay, this is really, I like these types of games, so I'm really into this. So, hold on a moment, who said that to me? The doctor who was waiting upstairs, who are you? Oh, psychiatrist. Whoa, what's wrong with Native American stuff? Good for him. Okay, so there is an indigenous people called the Amahai tribe. I think it's fictional. I don't know. I haven't researched this game. How do you know my name? From Emma? 
and cancelling. So there's no doctor patient come. Why are you talking about this? <laughs> Are you gay and single? That's always the question to be asking. Oh no, please don't let this involve a tribe. Of course he does. He's worried about Emma. Okay. Mm-hmm. Oh my god, don't be breaking doctor patient confidentiality. I have a strong suspicion. What? Oh no, nightmare dreams. Philosophical doubts, like, am I truly alive? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this guy's like 17, he's just like, this is way going over his head. Blue light, divine hymns, eternal sleep, welcoming her from within, so heaven. They were dreams like that. Then her body dissolved and was devoured by animals. Ooh. Maybe she's the bear. She transformed supernaturally. I hope you guys are reading along because I'm not reading this out. It's too boring. Oh, a patient in the exam room too. He completely forgot. What? Guys, remember that club wall was 8 o'clock when I meet the psychiatrist. We should write this down. We're underage, darling, and I think while you're trying to, you know, us hanging out together, that might be illegal. Let's see them rendered, but not rendered. There actually is quite a lot of detail when you think about it. I mean, those are all polygons. Nothing's pre-rendered here. That's why I would have, I wonder if anyone can get this running at a higher resolution. I might do an, a save. Oh, Renona, why are you here? How did you find me? So she's 18 and looking flawless. Emma's best friend. Emma had precious few friends and Renona had quite talent for getting her to open up. Metaphorically. I went to the sheriff's department and heard you were there. Did you see Morgan? Yeah, he told me about Kathy. I need to remember you. Emma, Kathy, Renona, Machu. She looks like Renona Ryder. Well, nowadays, but not back then. Shouldn't we go to school or something? Hopefully this is a weekend. It's a Sunday. Day of rest, but not for us. <laughs> Sure, why not? What else am I doing? Thanks for the ride. Oh. Do we get to drive our own car then? Kathy's last words, all the screaming, she said, no, don't. What did she mean? And what's the connection between Emma and Kathy? So what did Kathy see in the in the in the room, you know? Oh, this concludes the prologue. When starting a new game, you may press the start button while I control the match you. To skip to this moment. There is no penalty for doing so. Save the game, you must return to Matthew's room and sleep. Saving consumes one hour. So plan accordingly. Store it in the drawer. That will automatically keep track of clues and other information. Good luck! Original script, Resident Evil. Final localized script, 
Thurosan programming Nikita 600. Well, well done to you. You did a great job so far. And I'm sure it's going to be consistent. Well done. So we're at the sheriff's department. Oh no, we're on a timer. No. Okay. Ah, 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 it's on time. It's one. Did the sheriff call you in? Mary Lou. We have a politician here in Ireland called Mary Lou. Mary Lou Lang, 26. Sheriff's Department Receptions and Avid Gardner. Did her boobs just move? <laughs> Much to Morgan's chagrin. Okay, is Morgan here? Yep. After you go through that door, the sheriff's in the room on the right. Thank you. Be sure to knock before you enter. He is strict. What's he doing in the room before we enter in? Oh my gosh, we gotta be so careful because time is running. Time doesn't move. Whoa, whoa, what happened there? It's in this room. It's like a waiting room, holding room. You didn't have to like do a loading screen for that. Ooh. Investigate. There's a map of the town lying on the floor. Well, we're taking it. Yeah, we'll keep it. Thank you, exposition receptionist. Okay, we are playing for success. We're following the same school of Resident Evil Inc. We're just, you know, picking up everything we can. Clues, maps. Let's go. Let's freaking go. Wait, this is Christmas Day. <laughs> I just realized this is bloody Christmas Day. Why are people not like celebrating? Oh, because Americans celebrate Christmas on Eve, don't they? Which is really weird. But like, what were we doing Christmas Eve if not with our family? Oh. The low camera angle works better for this game than, than the other one. Oh no, it's a bathroom. Oh, do we need to go for a wee? Oh my god, we're wasting such precious time. So we know the psychiatrist will find them in the bar at 8 o'clock to unwind. I don't know what other things will come in. Is this detective? It is, isn't it? First room on the right. Stranding you. Ah, I've moved, but I didn't even click that. Sorry, folks. I couldn't even read that. But enough of that. I'm opening an official about Emma. Missing persons. Yeah, I heard from Renona. Around Lakeside, around 7 in the evening, right? Uh huh. Mm-hmm. There was something strange about Kathy. What happened to her? Does that have anything to do with Emma? Is it a job for the police? Yeah, you know who dragged us into the bloody police station? Why are we here? Be that as it may. Well, who's coming in? A neuter policeman. I like his hat. Hudson, you're back. How did it go? Hudson Lang, 29. A strong, silent type, my kind of guy, who serves as my Morgan's right hand man. Hmm. Regarding the holding cells. Oh, Hudson's hot. Can we? Is it legal? Well, no, we're underage, but like underage for cigarettes or underage for making some sweet, sweet love. And his mother was in shock and able to, okay. Oh, but we found someone who says, why, why do I keep talking about these generic white guys um, uh, at 10 p.m. last night? Who? Who saw Emma at 10 p.m.? Wasn't us. Go on, don't mind him. Mel Aston. And we know Mel apparently, because Matchy, that was the sound effect. That punk was such a rebel. Well, he was on his way to the bar. Pulled out to her, but she didn't answer, so I just let her be. And he hasn't been home all night. Where is Mel now? He's in the interrogation room. Now we're getting, can we go? Who's Cohen? Thanks for telling us that. <laughs> Thanks for that exposition, because I don't know who that was. Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, we do have a mobile phone. I wonder if I to use it. Even in Shamu, he didn't have a mobile phone. I had to use that bloody pay phone. And there was no number stored anywhere. We had the notebook, but it wasn't that easy. Can we loop the sheriff's desk? I would think it'd be so cool if the community can get in and show us those 3d models because i saw a painting a photo on the sheriff's desk but it's too low resolution for me to zoom in and see who it is but if we had the raw 3d file object probably would 
Is Hudson actually a closet neat freak? I hope Hudson's another type of closet hidden person that we can have some sexy time fun with. 1991, oh, I could be out, but I'm assuming in this 32 bit era video game, it's probably not a thing. Uh, Turd plays in the most peaceful town of America contest. So it's America, not Canada. There was a big parade, and my guess it wasn't Pride Parade. You really have to point him in the direction of things, don't you? So again, why are we on Christmas Day doing this? Probably shouldn't be here. We're so naughty. We're so naughty. Are we getting into her personal space? Can't loiter here. Watch me go, bitch. We are going into that cell. So what, can we actually get arrested in this game? That'd be very interesting. Well, there's two cells, no one's here, but maybe if he gets arrested, we can come in and talk to him this way. Because the game is really lax about visitation. So it's about half... Well, that clock says half 12, but that's... I'm guessing that clock doesn't move. Yellow pages? Wait, what? The yellow pages, I should be able to find any address in here, hopefully, okay. My house is in here too. Where's Cohen's house? Here it is. Deer Street in the west part of town near the forest entrance. Nothing to look up right now. My God, guys, we are nailing this investigation. Okay, so that means it's time for me to save. In the community readme, they were like, um, the game can freeze sometimes during the driving sections because I guess it was a bug to developers and never were able to fix. So they're just like save frequently and thankfully because it's an old game and we're emulating it, we can save whenever we want to. This is cool. This looks so open. Wow, look at the view distance. Now I'm more impressed now for sure with this game. That's a huge view this draw distance. Who has the bike? I'm guessing the rebel. I like his, I like his bike. But we have this really sad car. Let's get into the car. Oh my god, driving section. Here we bloody... Oh, is that, is that fuel? Oh, this car drives chaotically. And, oh wait, minimap. Oh, oh no. Oh no, we're out of car. Ah, okay, squares to reverse. X is the drive. Well, how am I supposed to know? God, you guys, what happens if we run out of fuel? Actually, I don't want to know. Uh, pause. No, that's just actually pause. Select. Can we open up a map? Do we have an inventory? Oh, God, we keep crashing. Oh, I don't know. Oh, my God, there actually are cars on the road. I thought it does dust. This is so impressive for a 32 bit game. You guys seeing this? Like, this other. Grand Theft Auto 3 could never... So I don't know where to go. It's the house by the entrance to the forest. How can I tell if we're east or west? We may just drive around and like... Downtown. Ah, signage. Okay, sorry guys. I, keep, I have to put myself in the Shenmue school of tosh. Oh, they're like, you cannot pass here. So this is the entrance to our town. Welcome to Missouri Falls. Oh my gosh. If, that was never going to be a thumbnail. Sure is now. Yeah, that's going to be a great thumbnail. I was going to say that's assumed the town's north, but this is so impressive. Oh, and it, the frame rate's gone up. This is going more like a 22 frames a second. That's really cool. That's the petrol station. Can we actually go into the petrol station? How open is this game? Like, look at that car, was just gonna casually drive along. Because you see, we're it's a small community, so they have an excuse for not having too many cars on the road. Oh my god, this game developer is genius! I mean, it's such a small community though. You wouldn't have economics like this. There wouldn't be that many businesses. Unless you're on a commuter belt. So we can't go in. Oh, we can go into the petrol station. Let's go in. Oh my gosh, you guys. I am really impressed with this game. Shenmue, eat your mother freaking heart out. You are not the pioneer you said you were. This game is totally it. And this is like an indie developer. Like Shenmue was like the most expensive video game ever made. And apparently like this is like an indie. Super impressive. And this is more open than Shenmue 1. I played Shenmue 1. Shenmue 2 is really open, but Shenmue 1, it's like one bloody street of businesses. 
it's fine. It's Renona I'm worried about. You know her. She's always so people really know each other in this village. Oh, that's awesome. I'm guessing this is the bathroom. So that's cool. But like, and I know we went for a wee when we first began the game. But when do we know we need to go for a wee? Because apparently peeing is going to be imperative to success. Like, is it going to be like The Sims? Is it just going to just tell us? Sorry, I'm trying to see if there's anything I can loot. So, we should kick the- Ah, let me just ask him again about his name. Robert. Check out the nose board. It's got the same announcements on it as the school and the hospital and other places. Ooh, where's the notice board? Okay, news. Today's issue. Two tragedy shatter, yeah, yeah, yeah. Teenage, yeah. Cat, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So we know this. Town talk. Yeah, we know that. We're going to sweep the forest. Please gather at the church at 1 p.m. Oh my god, we can totally make that. Oh my gosh, what do we do? Do we interrogate your man in his house? Oh, I forgot his name, or do we go to the church? Ugh, there's so much to do. Oh wait, there's people here we can talk to. Can I help you? Well, I don't know what he's filling up. He's just kind of like, honestly, touching his pants at the petrol station. Okay, that's... <laughs> you do you. Can we run him over? All right, it was worth a try. West, West. Oh, I can't read. That, that, was that no? Was that a rude word? Cock and pigs. <laughs> I am so headed here, folks. I can hear the church bells ringing, but I don't know where the hell. What's wrong with this bloody part of town? What's the trouble? There was a rock fall. I'll take two, okay. Road out town's blocked. No one's getting in or out for a while. It's so trippy. But we, that's the bar. We know where, we know why we need to go there. Eight o'clock tonight, psychiatrist. Come on, folks. We gotta make it to the church and I don't know where the bloody church is. Oh, I couldn't even read that sign. It's too high up. Oh my god, I want to crash this car. That's so cool, they programmed it and everything. Oh, tunnel. Same Nissan Micra. <laughs> How are we not dead yet? After all the crashing we're doing. This is so cool. Guys, this is an open world PS1 game. And like, it's truly an open world game. You can do more than get out of the, like, you can do a lot. So what's up here? Well, what's that sign say? Oh, I whoa, that car just yeeted us. So we're going the right way though to the church because we're gonna have to be there for one o'clock on the dot. So the church is like at the top of the mountain maybe? Because there's only one way we're going. Take me to church. Okay, look at us. That must be church. Oh, so this is church. People are already here being very excited to begin their, oh, look, oh God, we're wasting so much fuel. Oh, whoa, 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 we have an inventory enter a number. What did I even press? How did I bring that up? Got the wrong number. Oh, whoops. Triangle. Cell phone. Map. Waste bag. Oh, that's how you bring up the map. Gee. Oh, okay. We're literally on the wrong freaking side of the map. Where Nona's house is the petrol station. Is that a localization thing? Or is that truly where Renona lives? She lives at the petrol station. Cohen's Lodge is where we need to be to actually move things along. And is this our own house? Emma's house? Where's our... Oh, wait, our house is here. Bad memory. Okay, exit. Uh, okay, let's get out of the car. And let's get into the police car. I wonder if you can. We have, like, some time to kill. Let's do it! Will the game actually let us, or is it going to be like, yo, you left your car behind. Run us over, damn it. It's kind of basically whatever the hell it wants to be. Good for it. So, St. Peter's Church. That's cool. That was pre-rendered. Ooh. Sir, I'd like to make a confession. Is that a priest? Is that a nun or a priest? Get up in everybody's grill. 
That's Dennis. Pretty much everyone showed up. I thought 2,000 people lived here. This is not 2,000 people. Dr. Gruber, do you have a moment? Who are you? I came to Kathy's room earlier. Oh yeah, you're that kid. And Kathy kicked the bucket. That's one way to put it. And then she just died. Well, put it simply, the shock. She died of shock. That was Kathy, traumatized. She was in a safe hospital room. It doesn't add up. What kind of trigger it? That's the big question. Maybe more seeing more like it's ugly mug scared her to death. Or maybe all of the above. Poor Morgan. The only way you, Morgan, Father Barton, don't forget the nurse. The nurse? The head nurse. I recall her name. She's usually at the nurse's station. We're not going back to the bloody hospital. Are we done? I'm a busy man, you know. Thank you. Oh my god, is this the hot detective? He looks hot, whoever he is. Robert, the meeting is about to start. Uh, I'm sorry, but I can't let you attend. We have to step outside. I don't get it. Why can we not go? Oh, that's the side entrance. That looks like pre-rendered. I think maybe depending on different camera angles, they pre-render different things. Because it looks unusually high res, because the rest of the game wasn't like that. You can see the people rendered. Let me in, bitch. Let's sneak in through this door. Haha. -ha. We're so getting booted out. Oh no, it's a uh, storage room. Oh no. Oh no, I see it already. There's a bloody hatch in the church. What secret lies below this hatch, guys? Keep that in mind. There's a freaking hatch. M is probably locked down here. The priest's involved. I can see where this game's going. I I know this game. Oh, someone was someone was coming towards us. Who was that? Are we about to get slaughtered to some church music? That'd be iconic. Is it gonna be the clock tower man? There's only one room here. Oh, it's this bloody guy. Good afternoon. Don't go get in the way of my work. I don't know who the hell you are. I thought I was actually stuck there for a moment. Where's my car? Okay, it's like, whew. So at least the map told us that we're on completely the wrong side of the, 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 the world. The church is really isolated, isn't it? Emma totally could have been kidnapped. How's my driving? I wonder if we can afford to pump up our gas or is there gonna be a finance system? Oh my God, we really took the scenic route earlier. What an achievement that folks are human interactive. Well done, yous. Oh, we have to go the long way. Through the tunnel. Let me know in the comments down below what you think of the game so far. And give it a thumbs up if you'll enjoy watching me play it and I'll do more. Like, can we go into the motel and stuff? Or, like, because the, the mini-map really only shows things. Well, I suspect. Oh my god, did you hear the crow? Oh no. Oh, well, these are numbered. I think we could be here in the future. Yeah, look. It's locked. Well, reception's outside. Can I help you? Will this populate on the minimap or like, am I never coming here? Like, is this just like a regular business? Where are we? No, I never want to be here, I don't think. Maybe as a once-off, but it doesn't seem like it's a location that's going to be re reoccurring. It doesn't come up on the map. And look at the, you have the, the ice lake. Ah, oh, beautiful environments. Stunning. Wait, what? What? Bloody, I, I was never here before. I didn't see any of this the first time I drove. Am I going the right way? Well, that's our house. Once we get into the center square, take a right. We were actually pretty close to your man's house. I want to get this house. This is fancy accommodation. Hang on. First off, can I drive on the lake? I will not accept, Oh, Let me check out this house. This house looks super fancy. Rich people live here. Let me explore. Oh, it's blocked off. Game, it's so cool. A boathouse, we can actually go in here. Wait, someone's working here? Will this show up on the map as I find these new places or? Okay, it will show up. That's really good to know. Just so many more businesses than we initially taught. Like, let's sit here by... We can eat, get a coffee and talk. Yeah, let's eat something. We can order food. Well, how much money do I have? It doesn't say. Let's get some coffee. 
Oh, you can actually turn your head. That's hilarious. And change seats. Oh no, we can't. Okay. So we can talk to him. Can I help you? Oh, maybe I have to order milk. Oh no, I'm, I'm pressing the wrong button. X is like to quit. Oh, X is the action button. Sorry, folks. That's well, been really annoying to watch. Hup. Yeah, look at us drinking that coffee. Ha! Huh. Grand Theft Auto could never. I am like so impressed right now. Are they guns? No, they're fishing rods. Well, obviously, I want to come outside and check out the bloody pond. And like at the start, I was bitching about frame rates and stuff. G. How do I move? How do I steer? Like, why am I going in a straight line? What if I need to go back somewhere? Why don't I steer? Oh, oh, you can steer. The shoulder buttons. That's incredible. Like, you can actually ride a freaking boat in this game. I don't know why his head's turned the wrong way, but okay. Oh my god. Steering's an issue. I don't think we need to do this just yet but guys there will be a boating section coming up in this game oh i'm so excited hope this video gets views because i would like to come back and play this game like people talk about all the freaking time oh shenmue is such a marvel and like i like shenmue again i played it i taught the flower girl who worked in the flower shop and kept going to vancouver that was a weird subplot because that never went anywhere but like look at this there has to be a batch of mechanics there has to be. There's so many toilets. I'm like, I appreciate it. But like, our character doesn't need to pee, but he should wash his hands. Wow. I'm going to Google everybody who worked on this game after. I mean, oh my God, let's get like a little interview with them. I'm just so speechless by this. Like, what they have achieved here is incredible. And like, honestly, it's about as populated. Well, no, Shamu, it's populated. There's more people for sure. But I mean... You couldn't do this in Shenmue. Besides that one crappy quick time event thing where you had to follow, you had to get to like rescue your girlfriend or your friend who wasn't a girlfriend in time. Yeah, okay. So we were by the hospital. How the frick did we miss? Cohen's Lodge, okay. We need to really go to Cohen's Lodge. Okay, but you can scroll like this. That's cool. That road break, I, I, I need an explanation for what happened there. Oh my god. I need like a Grand Theft Auto 5 sat nav. I'm terrible. I have to keep checking the map. Which. Why are these cars being randomly parked here? Is that like a, is that, is that like a public park? Sorry, I, I can't help myself. I must investigate. Oh, not, whose phone am I ringing? What's here? Locked. I can't read that. Something woods. Balbury woods. So Cohen's house, or his lodge, or his hut, or whatever, is here though. Or am I? Oh wait, sorry. I should have taken it right. Ah, this must be the hut because it has its own dedicated parking. Oh my god, the houses here are so fancy. Why did this game not get more attention? Like that happens a lot of times though. Like, Sega could have purposely made a deal to bury this type of game. Like, it happens with films all the time. For, like, remakes of stuff for international films. So do you want to knock or just, like, barge in? Let's go in, baby! Is Cohen out? Well, can we go in then? Um, I guess we'll go to Emma's house? Or the Bower's Forest, we could investigate. His house is bloody by the forest. That's sus. That is so sus. Did you have anything to do with Emma or the Irish girl? We should check out the forest. We need to familiarize ourselves. Well, yeah, sure. Aren't people like not investigating? I mean, why do I keep ringing someone? People do not know how to bark here. Bower's forest. Let's go in. We must investigate the Bower's forest. Is there a scissor man? Oh, this is so mysterious. Can I kids and you see something? Emma yet, no news yet. How long will the search last? It's done before then. 
heads in station and the search party should be ready to share their findings. Okay. Like I'm surprisingly captivated, but at a certain time, if they don't, if the police don't start sharing information with me, interest will re will wean. I am not that concerned about the state of my friends and family. I mean, can we? Should we go to Emma's house? Well, yeah, it's just by the police station. We can, we can do it. That's a nice little housing estate. Don't know where if there's two thousand people, where they're living, but okay. So we're like right in front. This is Emma's house. This has to be Emma's. House. Yeah, I suppose like Emma of the mother. Yeah, because that house isn't as detailed. Police station, police station. They're a real they're a real community of people that finish work at five. What happened with the road there? How did it get disconnected like that? You guys, I only notice now, but like the weather and the skies change. Like the the sky changes like as it goes from day to night. And like our headlights are on, like that's I just realized our bloody headlights on our freaking car. I am so blown away by this. Okay, five o'clock, let me in. Mizuna Falls Sheriff's Department. Okay, it's five o'clock. And there's a big grey line across my screen. Oh no, that was just the map. Ten always been so quiet. What to our deal like little ten? I'm the mayor, I have to get a grip. Where is everybody? Sheriff! Don't you No, I didn't find Emma. Ooh, the bear. It's very important. Okay, time to talk to the sheriff. Why is the mayor just hanging around there? I like that. He, he always says knock before you enter. No one's back yet. Morgan knows I'm here though. He probably wouldn't leave anything like that lying around. You were blocking me off in the church. I remember you. Do you like plants? I guess I don't hate them. Or I just love them. I love the greenery when I wake up. Okay, where is this bloody notice? Oh, here we are. Can, I, can we go into the forest now ourselves? Or... I mean, it seems real dangerous. I'm exhausted after a day of doing nothing in this game. <laughs> don't know where to go. That baron have been the sheriff with his findings, so I'm just... I've had your chance, he told me to be there at 5 o'clock and I was, and he wasn't... Tardiness is not an option in the video game. Oh, I think I'm going the freaking wrong way. Do we go to Renona's house or do we just go back home ourselves? Just drive straight, drive straight until you can't drive straight anymore, and then take a right. But this commune, like look at this, like, little, like the little square, like there's a diner. Oh, okay guys, I'm sorry, we're, we're going off track view everything in life through my stomach so we must get out and investigate again i don't know how a town of only two thousand people can have so many businesses that's so cool i'm so hungry oh my god me too i just ate don't talk to me while i'm eating i have to focus on my food I gotta show my respect to the chef i think that's more of a japanese thing culture thing than President won't listen to her demands at all. Well, this time I'm gonna make him listen. Can okay, we play with the music? And toilets, super important. We gotta inspect the toilets. I read when the game began. Well, I mean, who knows? Oh, look at her. She's like, she's sitting on one. Oh, she's just by here the bar. Sit at a table, or do I have to sit at the bar? I said this one. Let's get some screw up. I love how you bang the table. Come over here, ma'am. Town's already on edge. I wonder if there's another protest at the Austin. It's a farm now. The farm workers are protesting because Mr. Austin won't repair the company housing. Mel's father. Who's Mel? The company's housing is oh Cochlin Peaks. I remember that name. That's where the church is. Guess it makes sense that Mel would be out there so late. To just be decent and repair them, like he's hurting for cash. So this is Lorraine, the barista. He's such a jerk. And question Who's Mel? Mm hmm. Oh my gosh, this, oh, this looks delicious. 
burger, omelet, pancakes, chicken, coffee, milk, daily special grits. I don't even know what grits is. Someone, if you know what grits is, tell me. Burger. Well, wow, cheeseburger hot coming right up. She's probably gonna just pull it from under the counter and throw it up on the table, isn't she? I love when games do that. No way, she even got it from the kitchen. That's awesome. And like, I could see the burger and I saw yellow. I saw some like chips. Nom, nom, nom. Oh my God, he's having a French fry. No, we'll get a coffee. How about another? Um, milk. To just wash it down. I know you love your milk, Matthew. She's the voluptuous diner woman. <laughs> Here you go. Let's drink our milk. I'm just chugging it. He almost jumped on the seat there from excitement. No, oh, I think we're done. Thank you, ma'am. I'm glad we have unlimited funds in this game. In Shenmue, we're just constantly poor. We're even more poor in Shenmue too. So much so that I think I'm in debt, which is why I'm afraid to continue playing Shenmue too, because I don't know what happens when you're in such debt. I mean, I must be a fail state. <laughs> I own so much money in Shamu too for that freaking hotel room. Okay, let me just get into the car. Sorry, I'm getting, I'm having trauma here thinking about Shamu too. Oh, look at that frame rate, 12 frames a second, uh, the emulator said. I mean, even if it told me like, what, if it had like an N for North, that would be so helpful. Please tell me this is right. Because I'm losing my marbles here. Oh, I think Renona like lives here. This is her house. No, that's not Renona's house. Where is Renona? Well, there's two doors, so potentially she lives behind that door. Come to top up. Stop your car within the yellow lines to get gas. Well, you know how it works, right? Well, you know what? Since we're here, we should probably get petrol for our car. X not being the action button is really throwing me off. Although I think some games in Japan isn't like X to cancel. Look at the weather change, that's so cool. Oh my gosh, look at us put petrol in our car. Yes, please, let me put petrol in my car. Oh, he's gonna put it in for us, that's so cute. Welcome, full service, right? Yes, sir. In Ireland, you have to put your own petrol in. Ooh. Look at that petrol go up. Oh wait, the Aston Farm, Mel's house to be. I guess we go check out the chaos there. Well, did anything new pop up on the map? But look how big this map is though for the game. And like, it's not, these aren't small roads, it's huge. And there's no loading screen when you're playing it. Like, who are you, punk? Who's this jogging little shit? You know how your notebook doesn't automatically new add new numbers? You gotta call the numbers first. And if someone picks up, it'll get added to your notebook. It's not enough just to see the number. Oh, our notebook gives us hints too. I keep forgetting that our notebook does that. So eerie. I love it. And they drive on the left side of the road. No wonder I'm, I'm driving on all sides of the road. It's not as if I'm... <laughs> That's a ridiculous thing for me to say. I've been driving like every freaking side. I'm glad it's a small town, Village of 2000, there's a computer software store. Let's make our way over to the farm. Young lady, why are you walking the streets late at night? Oh my god, let's harass her. I hope she beats us up. Oh man, I have no time. I have no idea where to go. At times like this, I just check the map. It's all you can do. Driving around town searching for stuff takes up so much precious time. The game's giving me hints. That's rude. Okay, we're going to protest. I think it's a detective game. Of course, there's some type of park mystery involved. I don't think I've been down here yet. Yeah, because I don't think I... I haven't driven over this before. Oh, my game froze. Playing on this, a modern, a, I used to use an emulator called EPSXE, which was like, used it since I was a child. But there's these new ones and you can actually have a rewind feature even for PlayStation 1 games. And I think that's essential because I was told in the localization, the localization community are like, this game is a freezer. So here's the problem. X is to cancel an action in this game, yet it's to accelerate. So, Help me out, computer game. I wonder if they always go to the, yeah, they're at the same place at the same time. Okay, see the game's loading it in. This is Anthem Farm. Okay. This is the housing. No, no, this is Mel's house. I don't even know who this guy is. There's nobody here. Although no, this house, this village has beautiful houses. Like, I think this house looks quite crap. 
this comparison. <gasps> it has a basement. Oh, he's definitely hiding a body in it. Oh, you. What do you want? Is there something on my face? Dennis, well, that's not Mel. He's going back to his house. He drives this yacht. How have I known he's able to park properly in this bloody game? Okay, well, then someone's here. Oh, somebody go in. So rude. Is Mel home? I don't know where he is. His room around the side. Look for him yourself. Honestly, what do you want now? Oh, so, he's so rude. So Mel, there's, I thought a body was put in the basement. To be honest, like, why do people in this community, no one likes to live with their parents or in their house? So I'm currently in my mom's room. Oh, we're going to Mel's room. Should we, we need to even knock. This is so rude of us. Who's Mel? I don't even know who this person is. And it's an absolute pigsty. Can we sleep in his bed? He's got like a babe on his wall. He's into motorcycles. Oh, was Mel the one who was at the police station? A walk-in closet, pretty spacious. Can we investigate it? And he just has like born naked babes. Oh, what's this? What's on his table? Besides dirty clothes. 9 p.m. Oh my god, we're not gonna be there in time. Motel. Okay, we need to we need to go. Oh my god, run. Get out! We need to leave. We need to leave ASAP. Oh my god, into the walk-in closet. We shouldn't be sneaking. Oh no. Oh my god, this is the most fun I've had in a video game in a very long time. Mel's hot. Can we date him? I would like to see it. Oh my god, Mel is so hot. Can we get with him? Screw this Renona girl. I know, I know. I've dealt with the Emma problem. And I've got it with me, so stop worrying about it. Uh-huh. Yeah, 9 p.m. tomorrow. I heard you the first time. I'll meet you at the cemetery den. I thought it was the motel room. We need to write this in a diary. Where is the cemetery on the map? What a whiny prick. Please don't have to change your clothes. Oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> oh, shove it, you old fart. Get in here this instant. Fine, fine. <sighs> my heart. Actually, like, cause, like this game, you know, like it's all to play for. I was like, what's actually gonna happen? Is it game over? Is it fail? I wonder, does the phone have callback feature? Oh, you know what? The time has actually gone off my screen. Yeah, I'm not falling for it. This game is really sophisticated. He could come back. Let's just get out of here. Sure, any though that he noticed that my car was parked outside. I don't know who he is. He has to be the one that they're interrogating with the bike, right? I don't see a bike, but I heard a bike. Like, can we still talk to him? We can go to the motel for nine. Oh my god, we have such an action-packed day. Can we talk to Mel though? Busy fixing. Ooh, shade. None of your damn business. If you want Mel, check his room, but don't disturb me again. Okay, folks, we gotta go to the motel. Thing is, I forget where the bloody motel is, so I might save just in case. Okay, you know what? I do want to investigate the farm. Let's just go over here and see what's going on. Can we break in? There's actually more to do. Honestly, I'm not, I'm not lying. But I feel like there's more to do in this game than in Shenmue. At least Shenmue 1. I, Shenmue 2 has a lot to do. But I mean, there's, there's so much going on that like I'm confused. Like in Shenmue, the whole point of Shenmue is like you're wasting time, you know, waiting for like to meet someone or go somewhere. But like I seem to never have enough bloody time in this game, which is kind of the chaos I'm living for, to be honest with you. 
So, where the hell was this motel? It was like kind of near the church. I have to assume it's that big patch of brown land, wasn't it? Do the motel. Nine o'clock. I wonder what's gonna happen at nine. I don't know what I'm gonna call this video, like day one, because like, like I've been playing for an hour and it's only been one day. I feel like in Shenmue, even things move faster than that. But they move faster than that because you, when your character gets, when it gets bored, you just go to bed and you're like, ah, oh, day off. Ah, bloody cul-de-sac. The roads aren't connected in this game. This is an absolute genius game. And what a shame that I don't think this, well, I mean, it never came out in the West. Like it's an American, it takes place in an American town. How do people sleep on this? I mean, is it because Sony wanted open worlds to be something that only the PS2 could do, so they didn't want to like show off PS1 hardware doing this? Because this is just phenomenal. Like how did this not get released? Because Clock Tower by Human Entertainment got, him, got an American release. I mean, I've watched people play it in English. No, oh, no, bloody hell, where does this... Is? Oh, I forget where the bloody motel is. I think it was around where the church was. I could be wrong though. Oh, we have a problem, sir. <laughs> Mia, Miss Keisha? So sometimes the game forgets to render in. You need an emulator with a rewind feature. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Let's just start here, okay? Eight o'clock. Oh, we have to go left. Okay. Oh my god, that's the bar where your man is. Oh, there's so much I want to do. There's so little time. Okay, we'll quickly stop off here and see what the freaking psychiatrist wants. Quickly, in, 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 in. Oh my god, such an, it's so action like There's so much to do in a day. I don't have enough time. There's not enough hours in the day. Matthew, okay, well, the time doesn't count. There's no clock. Matthew, over here. This is really cinematic. That's amazing. How goes the investigation? Stop with the detective thing. I'm quite impressed with what you- I found nothing. <laughs> Probably does. We're on the same side, Matthew. Maybe she was having an affair with her psychiatrist? Why aren't you sitting at the bar? Is he waiting for a special someone? I don't much like Wolf, the owner, so I prefer to I don't much like Wolf the owner, so pretty oh, sorry, I read that wrong, so I keep my distance. Some social distancing. He knows everything about the town's nightlife, but he knows me already. Get some info out of him. Interesting. Excuse me. Don't ID me, please. Wolf looks like a kind of dodgy. I guess you can smoke indoors in America. Can't smoke indoors here in Ireland. Let me guess, you want the hard stuff. You shouldn't be serving me, I'm underage, but I'll take it. I'll have a pink gin and an elder flower tonic. Wolf is 56 years old. You need to know this. He's the owner of Club Wolves. Club Wolves. He knows everything about the bars, regulars, and an expert on the town's nightlives. And you gotta order a drink. Well, tell me where the gay bar is. Oh, for God's sake, we're such a spaz. Milk? Well, whatever. I'm gonna charge us extra for it, I'm sure. Someone walked into the bar. Who walked into the bar? Oh, they're pulling up. Oh my god. Is it the hot detective guy? How much? It's on the house. Drink that and get lost. Oh, he's nice. Do you know Emma Rowland? So you know her. She comes in here often. Pretty girl in a dive like this. Turned more than a few heads. Once this guy was being real persistent, so Emma stabbed him in the tie with a fork. Of course the guy was in the wrong, so nothing came of it. Emma really did that. After that, everyone started thinking of her as this crazy girl. She always come in alone, yep. Oh, except one time she did bring in another girl with her. What did she look like? Why are you so curious about this? Look, I don't remember. Fine, never mind then. Drink your milk. Maybe a little coffee. Drink the freaking thing and we gotta go. What, you wanna order? No, we don't. We can get chips though if you ever wanted. Change your mind if you're entering and buzz off. We don't serve alcohol to minors, it ain't worth the hassle. Ah, we gotta be at the motel by nine. But thank you, oh my god, look at the hot guy. And he's in the area. Mel's in the area. Don't know why stiff like you came to the bar. Seems like you come here a lot. Should you be drinking? Shove it, I only drink milk here. Aw, it's a bit like Persona. I haven't even played Persona. I, I made a video about it for a list. I don't have time to waste. You either talk to me or do nothing. My Kathy's called her dad. Was it shock? Officially, but I have doubts. It's not that preposterous. 
Don't you have memories that trigger a visceral reaction, something that's stuck with you for years, but it has to be triggered. Can't you with them all by a bear? What kind of reminder like that? Only Kathy knows, but she did. So I can't talk to these people. They're just minding their own beeswax. Can I interact with the pinball machine? Nope. Alrighty. I want to investigate the bathrooms, but it's not worth it. We need to be at the bloody motel by nine o'clock. That's what I love about this game. It's, there's so much to do. I hope the rest, I don't know. If, I mean, if this video does well on YouTube, I'll, I'll play it again. I'll play more of it, but I don't, I've, I'm so busy. I don't usually have time to play games unless it's like new or whatever. Like, I don't think I can see myself playing this unless I'm doing it for YouTube. So you guys better hope this gets views. Well, I, hope, I better hope too it gets views because I really want to keep playing this. Like, I totally would do a let's play of this. Imagine if the motel is like on the other side of town. I know, I remember the motel being up the hill, which is a really weird place to put a motel, and that's why it's stuck in my memory. Because I'm like, this is just a terrible place for a tourist to be. But like, I like that the map even has variety. Like, you can drive under like a rock or in that, there's like a tunnel. Damn it, it's more housing. No, it's only bloody houses. Oh no. Oh no. Where the frick was this motel? I definitely remember it. I may just find it and know where it is. Like, I wish it didn't populate on my bloody mini map. Apparently, we're driving at 80 kilometers an hour. I don't believe that. Well, honestly, if the kid on the motorbike wants us to, like, you know, drive to it, <laughs> at least we'd know we're going in the right direction. Oh, we could have tailed them from the bar. No, so there's absolutely nothing up here. Where are the bloody motel? Where are you? Ah, oh, I was there before. No, wait, that's the dead end, isn't it? Total my bad scenario. I was actually very close to the motel. And I just needed to turn left instead of right. Uh -huh. So this is the bloody motel. So we are here and we are ready to investigate. It just said though, 9 p.m. You know what I mean? Uh, sir, can you not see us? Can I help you? Yes, you can help us. Start knocking on everyone's door. Just to see who's there. Nobody here. We can go in. It's locked. I don't know. It said motel, did nine o'clock? Because tomorrow at nine was the cemetery. So maybe they're doing drugs. Maybe it keeps changing every day. There's cable TV, cable TV in all rooms, cash only, and it's $25 a day. Or is that a four? 20 by, 25 by four? Why is that a four? Ah, bag. Note found in Mel's room. 9 p.m. Motel. Here we bloody are. Or again, did it change to the cemetery? I'm disappointed about if that's the case. It's nine o'clock. I don't think we should be out this late. Why the bloody motel? I better make sure there's not more than one motel in this game. Okay, this is the only motel in the town. And it is dead. So unless it's just changed from the motel today to the cemetery the next day at nine o'clock. Well, this will be traumatized into my memory of where this bloody motel location is. So I guess we'll just head back and Surprised no one was like, why are you loitering? Um, I do want to check the forest. And then after that, I think we should just go back to our home and go to bed. Oh, I thought that car was going to hit us. Why are people like just walking on the road in the middle of the night? Let me get out. Looks like a police officer. Met you, met you. There was, there really was a bear found in the forest. We found some huge paw prints. Can't wait for tomorrow. Are you going to do another search? Yeah, tomorrow, but Cohen suggested we go in fewer people this time. He says it's best to use a small team and tracking a bear. What time are you going in at? 7 a.m. sharp. We're meeting up at the forest entrance. Will you take me along? Wish I could, kiddo, but Morgan could wring my neck. Can we go into any of these other premises? Yeah, let's see if we can get into the forest ourselves. Ah, bloody road that leads nowhere. Wait, what's this? Is this the cemetery? Because if we need to be here for tomorrow... Whoa, why won't you let me in? Ooh, cemetery. We found it. At least we know we need to be here tomorrow at nine. That's super haunted. And do we want to be here at night time? 
Okay, but at least they'll populate on the mini-map. Match you. We're no no what's up. I'm at the park right now. Could you come by? What are you doing at the park? Just trying to think. Okay, I'm on my way. Ah, where's the park? Oh, crap. This is so much cooler than Shamu because he has a bloody mobile phone. This makes things so much easier for us. I suppose Shamu took place in the 80s. Okay, here we go. Hey, was that actually the cemetery? Yeah, it's a cemetery. So the park is there. So I'm pretty sure half of this video is gonna be me looking at a bloody map. I didn't come here to watch this. So we have to meet Renona at the park. What is she thinking? If she's, if we get there and she's been kidnapped, taken or someone, no, we're in a village. So we should be fine. Famous last words. But I'm telling you, I'm gonna be so angry if we have, we get, you know, banged up abroad or whatever. Can we actually use the telephone machine? Because I mean, we have our own phone. Can we actually use this telephone boot? Oh my god, he walks right through it. So this is the park. Riverside Park. Oh, it's nice. It goes up steps. Very fancy. Oh, this is beautiful. This is pre-rendered. Oh, there's another animation to go up this set of steps. Like, what else am I doing here? So here's Renona. Matthew. I taught you how to curfew. I snuck out. Well, don't be doing that. No one there's a killer on the loose. Something like you, what's wrong? Is it Emma? Everything about Emma has been a shock. Myself, it's different from me. I should have seen this coming. What do you mean? I was thinking Emma couldn't stand this town. Wanted to go away as far as she could. Mm-hmm, the bar. Yeah, 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 I was about that. Emma was wasted and I was horrified. I tried to take her home, but this creepy guy wouldn't... Who was the creepy guy? But then she said, Renona, that this is no place for girls like you. Isn't that messed up? Mm-hmm. So, there's two sides to every person. Anyone could have told you that. Uh, my mask is a fun being with me. So I told her, yeah, we're friends, remember? But then she said, would you be sad if I disappeared? Oh no, what did Emma do? This is like a real girl on the train type thing. Where were Emily Blunt? I don't know what these symbols represent. Is like square, like we're gonna kiss her or just give her like to make her feel better? Or is circle like, we, we, like it's done like we're gonna, it looks like he's crying, but without him, sh okay. Square? I should, that was not square for help, I should have done something. Oh, my controller is vibrating. Oh no, why did we press this button? Don't blame yourself, Matthew. I think we made the right decision, folks. All right. I bet Emma didn't want you to get caught up. That's why she never told you those puns. She cared about you. Thank you, Matthew. Whew. Like, I was like, I had no idea what those buttons meant. Oh, drive her back. Where does she live? Where does she live? It wasn't the petrol station. Oh, that's cool. The game, she can even follow us. Good job, video game. Oh no, she just glitched into the car. It says Renona's house is the petrol station, so I mean, like, what else can I really do? And I feel like we'd it'd, it'd pop up if we knew. Cone's Lodge, that was... This mini-map really doesn't help anyone. If it keeps moving, it changes the whole point. I need to know which bloody direction I'm going. Oh no, they both got out of the car. Don't do that. Come on, come on. Renona, I hope this petrol station's your house because that's what it says on the game. Well, I mean, I, I can't see you living here. It's not even like anything above the house. I mean, it looks just like a petrol station. But you know what, while I'm here. Honestly, Renona, two for one. Let's just top up. Top is up. Mm hmm. Thank you. Thank you. Anytime. Good night. Oh, Renona. Why do you live at the petrol station? Thank you for everything. 
Take care. That sounds like someone's final, you know. She better not go missing on us, otherwise I'm gonna be so angry. I am honestly exhausted. <laughs> and this has only been one day in the bloody game, but we've done so much. That, like, I wanted to check the park out, as you guys know. I was driving there. Maybe we should. I'm so, like, I'm so hooked on this game that I'm just gonna go for it. But, in case it's a dead end, I'm not driving back, so we will save here. Ooh, it's gone like almost black and white as so it's turned 11 o'clock. I wonder like if there's a killer at night time. I wonder if there's any punishment for doing crazy stuff like this. Like, I'm scared for our character's safety. What a concept. That was the cemetery. I wish it showed icons on our little map there. That would actually be such a huge help. <laughs> such a such a thing to do. Let's investigate the forest late at night. I'm super scared for our personal safety. Do I have police here? Oh come on, dude! Really? There's a one up there in there. So where do we live? We live in, not the diner, but like we live like this place, the electronics store. Oh, but well, that's the steak diner. I thought we lived like at the intersection. Oh, like the house is right behind us, but no parking. I just feel like I'd live somewhere where we'd have parking. I guess we park here in this for sale sign. I guess that's where we park. This is not where we live. Oh, where the hell do we live? Oh, I don't know. Is it in true here? Better be. Yes! We're home. Oh my god, we got a cute little doggo. Let's give him so much love. We need to give him food, some treats. Oh, it's closed. Nas isn't around. So we live in this little hut. And our cute doggo. At least we have a washing machine. Good to know. Yeah, I thought, I thought, when I started the game, I was like, oh my god, we're so advanced that we have an ensuite. But no, this is just our studio. Not even a fridge. We don't eat, we just eat at the diner. Oh, the diary. Let's check the bloody diary. There's a notebook in here and I want to read it. Yes, take it with me. About the notebook. Two functions. Record information about characters. Secondly, record phone numbers. To use the notebook, open the item window. Oh, I should have had this on me. Oh, okay. Well, we haven't had to do a phone call yet, so at least we have our notebook. Please tell me again, like, there's some information in it. Okay, Hudson. Oh, he's the hot one. Uh, the strong, silent type. Roland, she... Oh, no, she's missing. That's the father and the town's mayor. Okay, there could be something there. Okay, because I'm remembering these names. These names come up again and again. There was another Ringwald, wasn't there? So Robert's the father, daughter of his own. He can meet what Steve's going through. Chief of medicine at the hospital, psychiatrist. I thought the notebook was supposed to give me hints. This is just biography. Cohen, he lives alone in the forest. Lorraine is the waitress at a diner. She's blunt, yeah, kind. She's dating Mel, but they often fight. Oddly, that's what makes it work. So she's dating him. Oh wait, Dan is the town's most influential man. And he's the delinquent. He's the most powerful town. Man in town. Wolf. Oh, it's the old granny. <laughs> Father Burton. Dodge. Captain Nas. He's our legal guardian. She's the receptionist. Stein. And she died. So how is she related? That, I saw another lying up earlier. Who was she? Oh, I guess she's, I guess the gay guy's married to the receptionist. So sad. Should have been our boyfriend. We go with Cohen. Cohen, we like a nice daddy. Or Mel. Mel's probably more age appropriate for our particular character. Phone numbers. We get anyone's phone number? Oh my gosh, we had so many. Oh, sheriff's department. Oh, this is gonna help us out so much. Like when we need to do things, that would be such a huge help. Like if we get tips, ideas of who to call. Should we take another shower? <laughs> it's been a long day. Why does he only poop in his own bathroom? There's just so many bathrooms we went, we visited in this game. Yes, wash yourself. And get into your pajamas, young man. Oh, you need one outfit. It'd be amazing if the character model had a change of clothes. I don't think the game does that. 
wouldn't it, like, it wouldn't be too technically challenging. Like, you're getting, getting, you've already done all the hard work. What's this to you? Watch some telly. A photo of Emma when we went camping. I'll take it. She seems so alone. Oh no, just something eats by his bed. All right, guess I should rest up a little. Yeah, well, yeah, what else are we gonna be doing? It's night time. Five hour snooze, never mind. Uh, snooze? Yes, save data. Oh my gosh, this game. So unfortunately, he's Shenmue style, still, still wearing the same outfit. But at least we got a five hour slumber. But I think this is where I'm gonna leave it off for the video. Thank you so much for watching me do the first day of Missouri Falls. I really like this game. I hope the video finds an audience and that you guys enjoyed watching me play this as well because I'd love to make more of this. You know, maybe each video, because the game's quite long. It's took me two hours to play one day. So if we did like each day, how fast do things move in this game? Let me know in the comments if you played it. But I really like this. Wow, what a technical marvel for the PlayStation 1. That's incredible. I mean, the frame rate wasn't amazing, but like, it actually surprisingly wasn't noticeable. Like it actually played pretty well. And yeah, that's that's awesome. Like well done to the folks of Human Entertainment. I'm so sorry this game never made its way to the West because this is just one of those games I feel like that should be seen. And it's pretty criminal that it hasn't been seen. But uh, other than that, I hope you guys are keeping well. Do subscribe to the channel and hit the bell to stay tuned for future uploads if you like the video. But other than that, keep safe, keep well, and I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye, everybody.